Welcome to REJM 360 Entertainment News. I'm your host, Electra. For this news feature and more things Ari, download the REJM 360 app for iPhone and Android devices. Follow us on social media. You can also visit REJM.com. In today's stories, Ashanti and Usain heat up Trinidad Carnival. Did Bubbler die of a broken heart? Sly and Robbie win Juno Award. And Lucky Baby gets first dib on Rihanna's new music. Ashanti and Usain heat up Trini Carnival. Trinidad Carnival was lit. Just as Usain and Ashanti and Marshall. A few days ago, Ashanti posted a clip of herself and Bold dancing up a storm at Carnival as they watched Marshall Montano in performance. And in no time, it had amassed over 350,000 views and hundreds of comments. R&B singer captioned the video clip, just wanna wave on ya. Wow, what a wave that was. Well, we all know that Usain is the ultimate party animal, so it was no surprise that he was hanging out with his Caribbean brothers and sisters in the Twin Island Republic. Ashanti clearly had fun galore and even posted a picture of herself in Bolt and asked cheekily, maybe I can beat him in the triple jump though. Meanwhile, Ashanti took time out to shout out Michelle who she is obviously collaborating with. Working with this legend has been an absolute honor. Thank you, Mash, for your spirit, your energy, your humbleness, and love. You welcomed me and my team with open arms, and we became family. Did Bubbler die of a broken heart? Dancehall personality Denise Gray, more popularly known as Bubbler, could be counted on to provide a fair amount of comic relief when she joined some of the dancehall artists on stage to dance, and at one point she seemed to be Mad Andrew's sidekick. In fact, she was also famous for her character as Fat Marva in Mad Andrew's music video. But in the past year, she has been struggling with ill health and not grace the stage in a while. March 14th, the entertainment industry was rocked with the news that she had died and hot on its heels came speculation that she could have died from a broken heart. She died two days after her longtime 35-year-old boyfriend, Keon Wellington, was killed in a controversial police shooting. Bubbler was 53 at the time of her death. Condolences to the family of Bubbler. May her soul rest in peace. Sly and Robbie win Juno Award. Congrats to the Rhythm Twins, Sly and Robbie, and Dub Matrix for winning the Juno Award for Reggae at Sunday Ceremony Overdubbed. Sly and Robbie meets Dubmatics is the title of the winning album. The Juno Awards in Canada's biggest night in music is the equivalent of the Grammy Awards. The ceremony was held at Budweiser Gardens, London, Ontario, Canada. What a lucky baby! Where have you ever heard of someone being jealous of a baby? Well, you would be too, especially when that baby got the very first preview ever of pop artist Rihanna's new album. Granted, the baby wasn't really appreciative as he had no clue on how precious that moment was. Rihanna teased her millions of followers with the photo of her close pal, Jennifer Rosales, and little boy Joshua sitting on the mixing desk with ear defenders. Alongside the studio snap, Rihanna wrote, Thank you at Jen Rosales and the at underscore AA for blessing my day a little more. The green-eyed monster is out in full force, but we will wait patiently. That's how we wrap up for today. Thank you for watching Ari Jam 360 Entertainment News. For this news feature and more things Ari, download the Ari Jam 360 app for iPhone and Android devices. Follow us on social media. You can also visit arijam.com. See you soon.